What's up guys? So play in tournament day one started off amazing, exciting, stellar games. Play in tournament day two was a shit show. Now 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 you guys see the end results. You guys have probably checked the box score if you haven't watched the game at least and you're watching this video. Um I'll give the Hornets some love. The game was competitive up until halftime and then the door just got busted wide open in the third. It just got busted wide open. Busted wide open. Um they hung around for a little bit, like you said, the halftime. Yeah, but by mid third quarter, that's where it really just started becoming the game that it ended up being. And the Hawks showing, you know, that uh semblance of that team that made that surprise run to the Eastern Conference Finals. Um, That's why we put year. him on our list of uh, check this video. I'll play uh, play in team we think will go the furthest, and, and obviously yeah. after the Nets in the East because you know the Nets. Yeah, obviously but, uh, Kyrie, Kevin Love. I mean not Kevin. Dur look, Kyrie <laughs> popped off, but you know who didn't pop off? Trey Young. Trey, look, Melo Ball. Like if you look at his stats, they're good. However, no, not the Melo Ball. No, no. Not he really. needs he needs a little no not he's even he's missing some of that Anthony Edwards man he's missing some of that that veracity that fight that some of that Mamba mentality I, I get he's still I, very I, young yo, he's not yeah, very experienced in the league but like for the immense potential that I believe he has and a couple of other people it's like dude if you want to be the franchise face leader it's never too early look at Ja started doing it last year. This was Lamelo's shot to like. Yeah, no man. Step up. John, they got one more game though. No, 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 no they're no, done. They're no, done. Yeah, never no, mind. I'm thinking no, of you last night. Yeah, yeah, no, they're fucked. But like, again, back to back. Remember last maybe, year? Maybe, we La, like, maybe, La, maybe Lamelo's not as good as you think he is. <sighs> man, ja, I started yeah, thinking about that. Yeah, no, man, come on. It's kind of obvious. Ja, Lamelo. Ja, yeah. Lamelo. Maybe Lamelo is a very High tier Robin, maybe he's not no bad man. It's not that man. They just had nah, a bad. Definitely, they just the Hornets just had a very bad game, man. Like they turned the ball over. They couldn't shoot for like man. They couldn't make an open shot if if like the ocean was like the freaking basket. Um, they were turning it over and foul trouble, man. Including your boy Lamelo Ball. You look at his personal fouls. He ended up at five, and they did not keep their emotions in check. One of their better players, Bridges. Man, he lost his shit. Like, you know, yeah. middle of, like, towards the end of the game, man. And got that tech and got his ass kicked out. The Hornets, they're talented, but they got some growing they're missing, up. missing, yeah. They got some growing up to do. Growing up, and they're, they're missing some pieces, man. They're, yeah. They probably need a vet that can actually keep them in check. I mean, shit, they got some bets. They made a, they made a trade well, for... A vet that'll actually keep them in check. Okay, I guess so. We, I'm talking I mean, about a bet. You're in the locker room. We don't know what's going on we'll in that locker room. Well, I can tell you what's going on. Yeah, are you in that locker room? Yeah, I'll tell you this much. They're down halftime. You're thinking, okay, Hornets are going to come out swinging. This is an elimination game. And they didn't come out swinging. Like, you saw the start of the third quarter. They did not come out swinging. So it's like... That halftime, whatever happened, I don't know what happened entire. Like obviously, what happened inside, but I can tell you what happened inside. Not enough. <laughs> yeah, 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 of course, man. It's that simple. Um, no, nah, man, it's my miss. Jordan should have came down from the box and talked to his team. I mean, even if he did, man, no one's gonna stop. No one was gonna stop the Hawks tonight. And this, despite uh, Trey Young had a fairly good game, but he didn't shoot it as well as he normally does. Yeah, he didn't uh, have one of those ice tray. But games. but difference from last year, even though John Collins is injured and he seems like he's not going to come any come back anytime soon, DeAndre Hunter is healthy, one of their better players. Ooh. He showed up. Uh, Bogdanovich had a had a decent game. Uh, Capella, the whole team had a pretty good. He had a he had a pretty good game. Fifteen points, starters. seventeen. Yeah, yeah. I think it's time. You think it's time? The BTD stats time. Go. All ahead. right. Let's Big start thing. with the Hawks because everyone's already getting into it, and that is something that I do want to point out. All starters, as you guys can see, double digit points, double digit positive in the pluses, and look at Capella here with seventeen rebounds, three assists, two steals, three blocks, with just one little measly turnover for a total of plus twenty eight and fifteen points. That 
is beautiful. Yeah. And then Gallinari, 18 points. Hunter, 22 points. Young, 24 points. Herder, 13 points. And everybody, plus 10 for Gallinari, plus 27 for Hunter, plus 27 for Young, plus 24 for Herder. Now, we've said this time and time again, like, stats aren't everything, but, like, they tell so a part of the story. And that's a nice little story. And Bogdanovich also plus 17, 13 points. Like, I think one takeaway from this game is that this Hawks team is a little more complete than maybe a lot of people didn't gave them credit for. You know what I mean? I mean, no shit, man. They made it to the Eastern Conference Finals last Bro, year. Bro, how many... Pff, shut the fuck. We both thought that was like a l- possibility of being a fluke. It was, but fluke so, or not, they still made it. This shows that maybe not so much of a fluke. And maybe they were just had regular season woes and now that they got their shit together again, it's maybe all ab- they do another deep playoff run. It's all about being hot at the right time. Uh, because that is what the playoffs are about. Pretty much. And it also makes it beautiful and scary at the same time. So. Yeah. But look at the Hornets over here. The opposite of what the Hawks did. Everybody in double digits negatives for plus minus. And Rosier with 21 points. Lamelo with 26 points, but Lamelo was four for 14 from the three, Ass. seven of 25 field goal. He did have eight of 10 from the free throws, so that's something. Eight that's assists, five rebounds. Yeah, like Washington 17 yeah. points, six rebounds. Bridges 12 points. He was also 0 for four from the three, five of 11. But you got to give it to PJ, and everybody was saying he was seven from 10 from field goal, three of five from the three. Like PJ was doing his thing. It was just everybody else around him was not. And maybe if everybody was performing on a solid pl- or above level, maybe they could have taken it. Maybe. Well, either way, um, it should do an interesting game uh, for the fight on for the Friday. eighth seed. The Cavs versus the versus the Hawks. Who you got? Dude. <laughs> we have not talked about that. Yeah. <laughs> Um, off the top, I really would have to think that's my natural gut is telling me the Hawks because experience, mm-hmm. you know, more. They're both young overall, but like the Hawks have more experience. Like they had that last year's run. Cavs, they don't have no run. And you know how big I am on experience and histor- historical evidence. Mm-hmm. But then at the same time, it's only been one year for the Hawks to do something like that. They're still young. Cleveland is on some. The hungry shit. You saw how well Cleveland played yesterday. Yeah, but that's because they didn't. And they did not want to play that 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 second game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But you, they don't want to get eliminated either, bro. So if they can put on what they put on yesterday, that's an interesting, very competitive. I think this game, this Hawks, uh, Cavs game, might go down as one of the best games in the entire playoffs because one, it's elimination, and two, both these teams are scrappy. They're hustlers, especially Cleveland. You know what I mean? The way they've been playing this year. Hawks got it too, though. And Hawks, come on, man. You're not going to go down from a conference finals appearance to missing the play. You know what I mean? I can and do. Trey's not going to allow it. Because unlike LaMelo, Trey got ice cold in his veins. He got a little mom mentality. And yes, LaMelo, I'm calling you out. I'm trying you. I know you're not going to watch this. But if you do watch this, do fucking something about it, man. You know what your dad would do? He would have won this game. <laughs> So uh, who do you think is gonna take it, Cavs or, <laughs> or um, <laughs> Hawks? I'm gonna say the Cavs uh, still. Uh, Jared Allen, he's gonna come back. Uh, Mobley, he's he's there. Uh, Love, he looked rejuvenate, uh, rejuvenated. Uh, Garland, that that he played pretty damn well versus the Nets. The the Cavs are not gonna go you, quiet. You think one day rest is enough for Love though? <laughs> <laughs> they got they got a couple they got a couple days uh, off. However, oh, dude, that's true. Gut feeling is probably the Hawks are probably gonna find some way somehow because as we saw last year in the comments, I was we, gonna say you we, disrespecting we, uh, Trey again. We 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 kept on yeah. I le- I learned my lesson. I I I I, 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 me I can't, too. That's I, why, I can't disrespect. That's why I got the Hawks, bro. Yeah, so before you attack me in the comments, man, I'm like no, man. Yeah, I if mean, you guys go through our last year's videos, both. <laughs> We're low on the Hawks. So, but look, uh, you guys proved us wrong. So we believe in you see, enough to make the first round. Yeah, it's like, <laughs> yeah, it's like uh, the Hawks. Either go- way, whoever wins tomorrow's game, gonna get their ass handed to them. I like that. Heat in five. <laughs> All right, we'll, we'll see what happens. Heat in five. 
Yeah, I'm fight. feeling a sweep, bro. Nah, yeah, I'm just kidding. Yeah, I'm just... Yeah, yeah. <laughs> hey, man, if it was the Heatles era, then yeah. But I'm like, this ain't the Heatles era. <laughs> this, ain't, this ain't your older brother's Miami <laughs> Heat. <laughs> you know, type shit. Yeah, uh, all right, but anyways, all man. Right, so you're going with the Hawks. Because you said start off with Cavs, and you said your gut is Hawks. <laughs> right now, you got you got a K on who? I'll put my, my K on Hawks. I got to put it on Trey Young, man. Trey Young. He's a, I, I need I, superstar. I, I, he, it's if he didn't have this game to pop off, that means the next game he'll probably. And pop if off. anything, man, the circumstances are going to be more difficult because here the Hawks they were playing in their home 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 arena. Now the Hawks got to go to got to go to the land. That's true. You know and shit. That's gonna and that's gonna be a rowdy ass fucking. It is home fans right there. That is man. They haven't had but, the playoffs in a bit. Yeah, but so, let's not shit. forget. Like I said, Hawks got a that's starting five man. That's that's legit. I'm just saying, you swap Trey Young for Tyler Hero, the Hawks would be in the finals right now. However, <laughs> however, I would say this: the Cavs' size, Mobley, Jared Allen, they don't have John Collins. Uh, the Hawks, that's going to give them a lot of trouble. So we'll see what happens uh, regarding that. Let us know in the comments what you guys think, man. You guys got the Hawks? You guys got the Cavs? Do what you-, you guys think of today's game? Because I'm not gonna lie, I was gonna do this whole little rant video. Mm-hmm. I was thinking of like how the first day of the playing tournament proved. That the playing tournament is here to stay and deserves here to be here to stay. Oh. But then today's game happened and it's like crickets. <laughs> but then we'll find out how the Spurs and, and New Orleans one happened. I mean, for now, it's eighteen to twenty in the first quarter, and I think that game is gonna stay competitive because it's it's gonna it's gonna stay. You know why, Andrade? Because it's so it, fun. Now, okay, yes, that's nice. That's a good cherry on top. But these are like the home games for the Hawks. Don't you think the owner of the Atlanta Hawks likes that shit? That's an oh, extra home facts, game. They're charging. Facts. They're definitely charging. Hawks even tweeted too about yeah. like waiting for like something about. I forgot what the caption was. They're but, definitely like, yeah, charging playoff for playoff fans, prices. An empty arena. Yeah, I'm, uh, no <laughs> doubt. No, no doubt about that. Uh, and I, we we don't get elimination games in the game, like a one time elimination game. Like, and don't give me that. Oh, if it's a three three, the seventh game, whatever, cool. But there, this is different. Yeah, one yeah. game, one elimination, end all, be all. We don't get that in ba- We don't get that in in basketball or the NBA. So it's like, I like it. I really like it. Gotcha. Now let's make it for the finals. No, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Chill. I know. Right. right. Anyways, guys, appreciate all the love and the hate. You guys already know. Facebook, Twitter, TikTok, Instagram, all podcast streaming platforms. We'll catch you guys soon for now. Later.